Hello, uh, welcome back again. So in this class, we will learn what is a World Wide Web, or in short, www. So what is www or the World Wide Web? To World Wide Web, or in short, we can see it as to web, which is also known as a web is a collection of websites or uh, web pages which are stored in web servers and are connected to local computers through the internet or this website can contain like text pages digital images audios videos etc uh, different users or any user can access the contents of uh, this websites from uh, any part of the world over the internet using their devices like, like their computers laptops cell phones etc so this um, basically this uh, world wide web it is a, a global information system where different multimedia files are made available to the user so when we look on the internet this uh, and on this internet there are lots of these uh, multimedia files which are being interlinked to one another in uh, a web term we uh, call it as a hyperlinks or hyperdex so that all those information we the all this information can be accessed by the users without any um, sequence that means uh, randomly the user can access or can visit different website from uh, one link to uh, another now let's see what is a web browser so on the internet and uh, ww on the world wide web all these different files we need uh, some applications or some source to view or to access those files so in that process we use a web browser so a web browser or a, which is a commonly referred to as a browser it is a software applications or it is an application for accessing information on the World Wide Web. Some of the examples of uh, web browsers are like Google Chrome, Internet Explorer, and so on. So this um, web browser, they are basically used to navigate on those uh, different web pages or websites to view information. So this web browser, they act as an interface between the user and the internet, or the user and the and the uh, website so with the help of this uh, uh, different web browser uh, this web browser will render those information and then display it to the user uh, suppose like not every uh, everyone knows how to design a website or um, not everyone does not understand the com different computer language which is used to design a web pages and then to deliver different contents so so as to enable different users to be able to read and view those um, web pages this web browser they are used to interpret or they are used to interpret those um, web pages to the user so that the user will be able to view those information which is being displayed on the websites which are designed by using a different uh, computer languages so that's all see you in the next